YouTube family, welcome back or welcome to Recruiting Board. I'm Alex Segral and thank you so much for joining me for another week on the best channel on YouTube. It is playoff football in the state of Massachusetts and all around New England. If your local high school or if you are around a high school that is in the playoffs, please go out pay them maybe the $10 it takes to go and watch them play and go support your local high school. These kids practice all fall. They lift in the off seasons for these moments. So go and show support for your local high school and watch a playoff game. This one though is a very good one. It was the one that I thought would be the best game in the entire state of Massachusetts. And guess what? It definitely was. Brockton versus Methuen. These teams are completely different. I have seen both teams play and I knew it would be a fist fight and it definitely was. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Now I know both of these fan bases go absolutely hard. So please get me to 100 likes on this video. That is going to be easy. Share this video on all your social media platforms and of course, subscribe to the best family here on YouTube. I am so close to hitting 2,000 subscribers, guys. I'm only going to be like 100 away probably at the time of this upload. So help me get to 2,000. It was my goal to get to 2,000 before the season ended. And we're only like three weeks away now, guys. So help me get there. Keep the family growing. I also want to take this time to say I love doing what I do. I met so many great people this season. Thank every one of you that comes up to me and shows support. If you do want merch, I have a lot of people that ask me about it. Hit me up on Instagram, at Recruiting Board, and I am happy to send you it. It is only $25 for a shirt. Everybody asks me in person, how can you get one? Hit me up on Instagram, and we can make that happen. All right, guys. Brockton versus Methuen. Friday Night Lights, playoff football. Let's Get into the highlights. Tonight's MIAA action is between the Brockton Boxers and your Methuen Rangers. How you doing, bud? Call the heads. Heads is the call. Heads is the call. Brockton won the toss, they deferred. Newbie. Touchdown, boxers.
Third and short for Brockton. Give it to Montero. Come out of that one. Touchdown. Austin Newby for a second touchdown. Montero is in touchdown. Sorry, getting one sec. That's good. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Fourth and goal, the boxers are going for it. Rangers stop them. Probably end up with KO. Oh, What? 
Easy. She just won 200 bucks. Montero. Oh, flea flicker. through with reckless abandonment though. Third and two, this is a huge play. Rocked in, I think they, did they get it? Yeah, they got it. It's a first down. Oh man. The season on the line, fourth down, 39 seconds. Montero. Is that a first or? Oh, they're gonna have to measure that. This is coming down to the absolute wire. Fourth down. Season on the line for Brockton. They got it. Montero. Oh, six seconds. There's three seconds left in this game. Holy shit, guys. They're going for it with three seconds left. Asanubi. It's a pass. <laughs> Whoa, Shane, my heart's still pounding from that one, bro. Man, talk about the win. What what a game for you. you Great game. I mean, we played a great team, a great powerhouse like Rockton. I mean, final score 37-34. It was competitive throughout all four quarters. They're a great team, hard hitters, fast, athletic. I mean, we just played a great game. We executed very well on offense. Defense stepped up when we had to, and uh, Franklin. Yeah, yeah, probably. This was a grind, man. Like, not not much defense, but you know, they win. Defense had a great play at the end. Silver, one of our captains, he really stepped up big, had a great pick. They had a great team, though. Very well respect them. All respect all their team, their players, the coaches, great organization. Shane, recap this season for me. I feel like everybody knows your name now, you know? Yeah, I mean, it feels great. I mean, I'm only a sophomore. It feels great to put my name on the map. I think I'm leading the state in scoring right now. Yeah. It feels great. I mean, show people what I can do. I don't know, hopefully, offers come rolling in soon, maybe. I, I'd, I'd bet that I bet money on that one, man. So Shane, you want to shout out your friends and family? Yeah, shout out all my friends, all my teammates, my coaches, the student section, 
big help tonight, very loud. All my teammates, all my coaches helping me out, showing us what we can do. Yeah, can you do me one favor? Sir. Can you say it? Shout out recruiting board, baby. Yes, yeah. Sir. Back in the state right here. Let's go. Gamer. Sir. We got Coach Ryan Drew Eason. Coach, what an emotional win to start the playoffs. Yeah, I mean, they, they were hammering us inside. We threw every combination we possibly could to try to stop them. We ended up making a couple stops, a huge one, obviously, at the end. You know, but we put so much pressure on teams because guys like this, all right, execute our offense so well. Um, and, and, and just unbelievable game by him. I don't even know what his yardage was, but it doesn't matter. The efficiency of Drew Easton until you've met and seen how efficient he is, all right? He was 19 of 20 last week, and I don't know, it'll probably be close this week. I think so. Uh, ridiculous uh, efficiency. And if you're looking for a freaking quarterback, here's one right here. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. I'd agree. This game was so huge. Really similar to last year's game versus Everett. Both both teams have D1 talent. Both came in 7-1, but their conference play wasn't that good. So it kind of put them like a little bit lower at the 9 seed. And both teams, one of the best teams in mass history, both of them. And same thing tonight. They just played an awesome game. What was the preparation like going up to this week? Yeah, I mean, they on film, we exchanged three films. That's what the MIA rule is. And they have like four different quarterbacks, and we saw that running game that they had. We also saw their empty game. They run about ridiculous offensive sets, so we had to prepare for like 10 different things. In fact, we did spend a lot of time on the, on the tight stuff that they ran a lot in the game, thank, thankfully. But they still, they're a bear. They're big up front. Biggest team we've seen up front. Athletes that play quarterback are all great. Uh, they run so hard, and man. They got so many extra yards today. They were, they were incredible. They were, I, I didn't, I, I couldn't believe when I saw them live how hard they ran. What a, what a, what a credit to Coach Colombo and, and his staff and those kids. Cause they play, if they play blocked and tough, they sure do. Absolutely. I mean, I was saying it's a street fight. You know, I feel like the program's really kind of turned this corner though. Like people are now noticing Methuen. Drew, what's that like? You know, you're one of the pillars of it. Yeah, uh, definitely our dynasty is definitely starting. We started last year, even the year before that. And we're just kind of slowly getting better each year. And this program is going to be really good in the come, upcoming years. Yeah, I hear this is a junior heavy class, huh, coach? Sure. Yeah, yeah, there's, there's a lot of work we do every year. Each year is unique, so we'll, we'll deal with Franklin right now. Got our recruiting board. Hell yeah, Drew.